All right, here we have the P PWM drive circuit. Uh, testing a couple things here. I have a couple potentiometers hooked up to simulate voltage, marked V, and current I. Um, so the first thing I've done is the small potentiometer on the left is the idle voltage when the current is zero. Uh, that's the voltage that's going to store the capacitor or keep the capacitor bank set. Uh, so we're going to go over. Uh, I'm going to adjust this knob here. And we're going to go look at the PWM signal on the scope. So right now we have nothing. I'm going to adjust the knob here. And we can see the PWM driver is kicked in. It's increasing the drive, trying to increase the voltage. So I'm going to increase the potentiometer to simulate uh, the voltage increasing on the capacitor bank. And you can see that the drive starts to drop. So as I move the potentiometer back and forth, um, the PWM driver is going to adjust itself to try to keep a stable uh, what it thinks is a voltage. Uh, so that's another part that's working good in this circuit. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and find a stable spot. The second part we have is once we get up on current uh, out of discontinuous mode, uh, it then uh, PWM driver then washes the uh, current sense which comes in on this three pin header on the uh, green wire here and I'm going to simulate that with this potentiometer uh, connected to positive 5 and the board floating ground and the green wires out to the sense uh, for the current so let's get that uh, in a second here get this thing back up to generating Alright, so this thing's very, uh, very touchy. So I've got the potentiometer here adjusted to, um, uh, I've adjusted this small potentiometer here on the right to a set current value. And this is simulating uh, I, current in. So I'm going to adjust this. I'm touching it just a hair. And you can see just touching it causes the PWM to go up and down. And I'm reducing the apparent current in right now, so it's trying to drive high. And I'm increasing, increasing the apparent current in. And you can see the drive is now dropping because it sees that it's getting closer to the, the, the programmed current. Uh, so I'm pretty happy the PWM board seems to be working um, as it's supposed to. We saw the soft start earlier. So... Uh, no complaints. This is looking good. I should have a uh, have this installed, and then I get to worry about these uh, MOSFET drivers over here next.